Hello guys, thanks for watching this video. Uh, I would really appreciate any likes and comments from your side. <coughs> Sorry. In this video, I would like to show you how you can set a proxy for Docker. Suppose that uh, in, you have a proxy server in your organization and you want to download any Docker image from the Docker Hub, GitHub or any other repository. So in this case, uh, you have to configure uh, your proxy server for uh, Docker daemon otherwise you cannot download anything uh, so first of all we check if um, Docker is already installed on our machine or not for checking that I open I've just opened the terminal and in terminal I type Docker and I press enter you see command Docker not found it means that uh, Docker daemon is already uh, not installed on our machine so first we have to install docker for installing docker uh, we have two options we can either use one of the uh, linux repositories to um, pack it to install docker or we can use the website of docker if you want to use the website the construction of the website of docker for installing you have to open the browser and type install docker on ubuntu and after that press enter and here under https colon front slash front slash docs dot docker dot com uh, this is the official website of docker i click on it and we open the official website of Docker. I scroll down and uh, there is another uh, instructions here, uninstall the old version and here the installation methods, install used uh, repository and here set up the repository. You can use these commands uh, to install Docker, but as I said, uh, you can also install it with this commands here the difference is if you use one of these commands to install docker you may not get the latest version of docker but the version that you get is also okay and um, you can use it for your jobs so uh, we use one of these commands the second one docker io is the command that will be used to installing uh, docker i make a copy and I paste it here and after that I press enter and here I type Y and um, press enter and here you see the following additional packages will be installed plus Docker.io and I press enter and we just wait until it will be installed on our machine it takes like any other packet sometimes we uh, don't need to do anything we have just to wait until the installation is done so it's done you just clear here a little bit now we check the version and we check if docker is installed for that i type docker minus minus version and i press enter sorry version i made a mistake sorry so docker minus minus version you see that this uh, version of docker is installed on our machine so I clear here and um, after that uh, we can check the status of Docker if Docker is enabled and running or not. For checking the status we use the command sudo systemctl status docker service and after that I press enter and you see that uh, docker is running is open is running so after that we want to check if um, 
Docker already can pull an image from the Docker Hub for us or not. The simplest uh, way to check that is this command zuru docker run hello world so if you want to download uh, any docker image from the docker hub you use this command docker run with zuru and that is the image and we want to check if the connection is done and if everything works after that i press enter and we see what happens okay here i explain you something about the text uh, first in the first line it says unable to find image hello world latest locally it means that when we run this command docker run first docker uh, tries to find the image locally in our machine if it cannot find it, then um, it tries to pull the image from the Docker Hub. And if you see this here, hello from Docker, it means that uh, everything works and uh, you can already uh, pull and download any Docker image uh, that you want from the Docker Hub repository. Okay, now mm, we want to uh, configure the uh, our proxy server for Docker so that the communication uh, works through the th uh, through our uh, proxy server. Uh, before that, I would uh, show you how you can how you can also check the um, images that already are pulled and installed on your machine. For that, you type zuru docker images, zuru docker images, and after that I press enter, and you see that hello world is already um, on our machine. Uh, I just remove this uh, image, and after the setting uh, of the um, uh, proxy server we try to download it one more time and we see what happened so to look at image removed sorry image remove minus f to force it and image id we copy it and i paste it here docker zuru docker image remove this command will be used to delete and to remove any docker image and this is uh, the id of the image and i press enter you see it will be uh, deleted and if we check the images one more time you see there is now image running okay for configuring the proxy settings for docker first we have to create a new directory uh, under etc system de system uh, so to create a new directory sudo make tar minus p etc system d system and front slash in this directory must be docker dot service dot d uh, we create this new directory with the use of make dar and this directory as i said must be docker dot service dot d and i press enter now we have this directory we uh, change the directory to that Cetera, system D, system and docker service D. I press enter and we are here. So we don't have any file here. We set uh, our configuration file for uh, proxy setting here. Uh, for that, we have to open a new file. I use nano, sudo nano, 
and the file in this case must be http minus proxy dot conf that is the file that we need and this file will be will contain uh, the proxy settings for docker i press enter and i open the file and in the file we have to define um, a service block service sorry service block and under the service block we have to define two environments for our proxy by on meant the first one the first uh, environment is for uh, http http underline proxy and after that http column fast slash fast slash here you have to put the url of your proxy server we say for example your minus proxy column and port it must be and font slash it must be the um, url here the url of your proxy we need another environment so i just make a copy of that i don't want to type so many things the second environment is uh, for https 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 underline proxy minus http exactly like above sorry your your proxy and port and front slash and okay it's closed now um, we just save this file by pressing control and X and after that I type Y and press enter and the file if I make a list will be here saved um, in order to use our new proxy settings for Doka, we have to uh, reload daemon and after that we have to restart uh, Doka one more time so sudo system ctl daemon reload i press enter and sudo sudo system ctl restart docker service i press enter and we check the status if it runs or not so docker runs and this time it uses the proxy setting of our organization to check that we try to pull uh, the first image one more time from the docker hub sudo docker run hello world and i press enter and we see what happened so you uh, see that the proxy setting this is an error from daemon first uh, docker tries to find um, the image locally in our machine and cannot find it and after that tries to get it from the uh, docker hub but here uh, the proxy connect um, failed failure there is a failure it means that docker cannot find this um, uh, proxy server and it is uh, totally okay because your proxy i don't have this proxy and um, uh, the machine cannot find it also but if you set the url of your proxy 
um, the Docker will um, make a connection with Docker Hub and then pull the, uh, the Docker image from Docker Hub through the uh, your through your pr uh, proxy server so that's it we have done it and thanks for watching